This video shows how administrators can configure the dispatcher workspace to streamline field service operations. The dispatcher workspace is the central hub where dispatchers manage field service tasks, view agent details, assign work orders, and optimize field technician schedules. We'll start by configuring filters. Filters help dispatchers narrow down their view to focus on specific tasks or agents. You can configure filters based on attributes like location, priority, or technician availability. Let's set up a task panel filter, which is a default filter that determines which tasks appear on the task panel in the dispatcher workspace. To do this, we'll navigate to the task panel dispatcher filter page where the base system panel filters are listed. To create a new filter, we'll click New. We give the filter a name, provide the filter conditions, and the display order value. We save the form and then click Update. The filter is created. The task panel sorting page lists the default sorting options. There's a highest priority first sorting option. Let's go ahead and create a lowest priority first custom sort. We give it a name, enter the display name, select priority as sorting criteria, choose the sort order and then click submit. Custom sort is created. Now, let's see it in action in the dispatcher workspace. We're logged in as Lisa, who is a dispatcher. We'll go to Dispatcher Workspace and click the Sort icon to find the priority lowest sort we created. When we click it, tasks are sorted with the lowest priority task on top. Dispatchers can create ad hoc filters to filter data by conditions not covered by the default filters. To do this, we'll click the Filter dropdown and select the Create New Filter option. We'll define the filter conditions and then click Update. We've created an ad hoc temporary filter. To save this filter as a permanent filter, we need to click Save Filter and give it a name. Upon saving, this filter will show up in the filter list. In the Resource Filter section, we can sort tasks by agents, crews, or skills. Let's view the tasks assigned to Cindy. We can save these filter conditions as default or even clear them. To add more details to resource records, we go to Settings, select Resources, choose the fields we want displayed, and then click Save. The resource fields we selected are now displayed. Dispatcher filters and custom sorting are efficient tools to view and manage pending tasks and available agents in Dispatcher Workspace. For more information, see our product documentation or knowledge base, or ask a question in the ServiceNow community.